Show me some love. Like, comment, share, and subscribe. Eighth grade, unit four, lesson nine. When are they the same? Problem one. Cell phone plan A costs $70 per month and comes with a free $500 phone. Cell phone plan B costs $50 per month but does not come with a phone. If you buy the $500 phone and choose plan B, how many months is it until your cost is the same as plan A's? Okay, so you bought the $500 phone and chose plan B. So that's $500 plus $50 per month. For plan A, the phone is free, so it's just $70 per month. Plan A, the first month is $70. And plan B the first month is $550. For plan A, after two months, you would pay $140. And for plan B, after two months, you would have paid $600. The question is, how many months is it until plan B costs the same as plan A? After 25 months, plan B costs $1,750 and plan A costs $1,750. We could write this out as an equation. 70x equals 500 plus 50x. And subtract 50x from both sides. Now the equation reads 20x equals 500. Divide both sides by 20. And the equation now reads x equals 25. At the 25th month, the cost is the same for plan B and plan A. Problem number two. Priya and Han are biking in the same direction on the same path. A. Han is riding at a constant speed of 16 miles per hour. Write an expression that shows how many miles Han has gone after t hours. The expression would be 16t miles. B. Priya started riding a half hour before Han. If Han has been riding for t hours, how long has Priya been riding? Since Priya started riding a half hour before Han, Priya has been riding t plus one half hours. C. Priya is riding at a constant speed of 12 miles per hour. Write an expression that shows how many miles Priya has gone after Han has been riding for t hours. Since Priya is riding at a constant speed of 12 miles per hour, the expression would read 12 times t plus 1 half. D. Use your expressions to find when Han and Priya meet. Han's expression is 16 t miles, Priya's expression is t plus one half hours, and the expression that represents Priya riding at a constant speed of 12 miles per hour is 12 times t plus one half. We'll use this expression and Han's expression to help us find when Han and Priya will meet. 16 t miles equals 12 times t plus 1 half. That's the same as 16 t equals 12 times t plus 1 half. 12 times t equals 12 t. 12 times 1 half equals 6. Now the equation reads 16 t equals 12 t plus 6. Subtract 12 t from both sides. And now the equation reads 4t equals 6. Divide both sides by 4. And now the equation reads t equals 6 fourths, which is equivalent to 3 halves or 1 and a half. Han and Priya will meet in 1 and a half hours. Problem number 3. Which story matches the equation? negative 6 plus 3x equals 2 plus 4x. So for story A, I see some values that make sense. The negative 6, the 2, the 3, the 4. In story B, this is what doesn't make sense. 
They're playing a card game where every time they collect a pair of matching cards, they earn X amount of points. Karen has negative six points. I don't understand how they can earn negative points. If you're earning points for every time you have a pair of matching cards. So I'm going to go with story A as the story that matches the equation. Problem number four. For what value of x do the expressions have the same value? Subtract 2 thirds x from each side. Add 6 to both sides. Multiply both sides by the reciprocal of 2 thirds, which is 3 halves. When the value of x is 12, the expressions have the same value. Problem number 5. From 8th grade unit 4 lesson 8. Decide whether each equation is true for all, 1, or no values of x. A. 2x plus 8 equals negative 3.5x plus 19. Add 3.5x to both sides. Subtract 8 from each side. Now the equation reads 5.5x equals 11. Divide both sides by 5.5. x equals 2. And this is true for one value of x. b. 9 times x is 9x. 9 times a negative 2 is negative 18. Subtract 7x from both sides. Add 18 to both sides. Divide both sides by 2. And x equals 11.5. This is true for one value of x. C. 3 times 3x is 9x. 3 times 2 is 6. Bring down the negative 2x. 9x minus 2x is 7x. Now the equation reads 7x plus 6 equals 7x plus 6. This is true for all values of x. Problem number 6 from 8th grade, Unit 4, Lesson 6. Solve each equation. Explain your reasoning. A. Negative 2 times 5 is negative 10. Negative 2 times negative 3d equals positive 6d. Subtract 3d from both sides. Now the equation reads 16 equals negative 10 plus 3d. Add 10 to both sides. Now the equation reads 26 equals 3d. Divide both sides by 3. And the value for d equals 26 thirds or eight and two thirds. B, negative three times four equals negative 12. Negative three times negative k equals positive three k. Now the equation reads two k minus 12 plus three k equals three k plus four. Combine like terms, two k plus three k equals five k. Now the equation reads 5k minus 12 equals 3k plus 4. Subtract 3k from both sides. Add 12 to both sides. Now the equation reads 2k equals 16. Divide both sides by 2 and k equals 8. C. I could rewrite this as 3y over 9 minus 6 over 9 equals 4 over negative 3 minus 2y over negative 3. Minus a negative or the opposite of a negative is a positive. So you can rewrite negative 2y over negative 3 as positive 2y over 3. Since we're adding and subtracting fractions, let's get common denominators. Let's make the negative 3 a negative 9 by multiplying it by 3, and multiply the 4 by 3 to make it 12, and multiply the 3 by 3 to make it 9, and the 2y by 3 to make it 6y. Subtract 3y over 9 from both sides. 
Add 12 ninths to both sides. Combine like terms. 12 ninths minus 6 ninths equals 6 ninths. Multiply both sides by the reciprocal of 3 ninths, which is 9 thirds. Right now you can multiply straight across or you can cross cancel. 9 goes into 9 once, 3 goes into 3 once, and 3 goes into 6 twice. Now we can multiply straight across and the value for y is 2. Problem number 7. Describe a rigid transformation that takes polygon A to polygon B. Here's what we can do. Here's another look at it. Rotate polygon A 180 degrees around center point zero zero. Help me disrupt YouTube's algorithm by liking this video, commenting on this video, sharing this video, and subscribing to my channel. Thanks. I appreciate it.